Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's Autos. In this video, I'll be showing you how to download Dropbox in Laptop. But before we start, hurry up and check out our latest offer just under this video. So let's get started. So how do we actually download Dropbox, the application itself, into our laptop? Well, this one is actually pretty easy. So what we need to do first is we need to visit the official website of Dropbox, which is dropbox.com. Now, in this case, if you're already in Dropbox, make sure that you're currently logged in for you to access the links that we'll be going in into. Now, in this case, once we are in Dropbox, what we need to do next is we need to choose or look for the option or link that says Get App. So at the top right of your screen, you should see this section here. Go ahead, hover over it, and you have the two options. Now, Dropbox here is actually available both for desktop or for your laptop as well as on your mobile. Now, since we want to download this into our laptop, go ahead and choose the desktop app here. And from here, you should see the download button. So let's go ahead and click on the download button here on our screen. And that would actually download the installer for Dropbox here. Now, once the installer is currently downloaded or once you've downloaded it, you go ahead and click on the download folder here. Click on the folder icon. And from here, just double click on the Dropbox uh, icon or .exe file here, click on run, and that would actually initiate the uh, installation process. Just click on yes if it requires any further uh, details or uh, permissions on it. And once you've done that, that would actually start the installation. So just close a few files here and folders and wait for it to actually start downloading and install Dropbox into our account. So let's just wait for it. Now, once the installation is complete, you should see the next window here, which in this case, you just need to create your account or sign in into your account. Now, if you want to sign in, just click on sign in with Dropbox and just click on open sign in. And that should actually redirect you to another window, which in this case, you just need to sign in. And that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.